The frightful night could not dampen the spirits of young Mr. Frankenstein as he delivered his optimistic financial forecast. So accordingly, the simulation analysis shows net accretion in off balance sheet derivatives and a positive correlation with identifiable intangibles. It was then that he learned about the discovery of his eccentric grandfather's last will and testament. It named young Frankenstein as the heir to an eerie castle and all the mysteries that lay within. Welcome, Master. I've been expecting you. You have? Yes. My grandfather worked with your grandfather. Then perhaps you know the whereabouts of his secret laboratory? But of course, Master. Walk this way. No, walk this way. The lab, Master. This is fantastic. And these must be my grandfather's notes. <sighs> the reanimation of lifeless matter. Mm-hmm. I see. Yes. This could work. Frankenstein carefully went about recreating his grandfather's experiment. The fiduciary infuser is calibrated. Everything is ready. Now we just need an exquisite brain. Do you have the name I gave you? Yes, master. It's right here. Just the name, of course. Of course. Never mind. Turn on the generator. Yes, master. Nothing. I'm gonna need the whole enchilada. Bring my creature to life. It's no use. Sorry, master. At least now you've got time for that investor conference call. It's alive. This doesn't seem right. You're sure you got the brain I asked for? Yes, buff. Buffalo, I believe it was. You had me put a buffalo brain in this monster? Oh, I didn't mean to fail. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. What have I done? The lovely Fraulein Griselda was a keen judge of character. She saw not a monster, but a man that was kind, strong, and proud. Well, you're no monster. Where are you from? Oh, the old Frankenstein place? We need to get you home. With the help of Griselda, the monster returned home to the castle. Frankenstein used the neurotelerometer to fill the creature's buffalo brain with the sum of essential human knowledge. The monster learned quickly and saw that every day was an opportunity to be the best he could be. Soon he joined Frankenstein as co-CEO of the company. I'm just a monster with a buffalo brain. I don't understand your fancy technology and your financial forecasting models, but I do know that if you work hard, you're responsive to your customers, and you treat everyone with kindness and respect, there's no stopping this company's momentum. Oh yes, thank you. We're supposed to wish everyone a happy Halloween. Everybody come in. Happy Halloween!